Welcome back, everybody. We're back with another tier list. Today, we're going to be ranking candy. I can certainly say I'm excited for this one. I love some good old sugar every now and then. So kind of like how Michelle loves to get George's sugar. And I'm not talking just about candy Obama. Oh, shut the hell up, Donald. Man, where the hell is Joe? He's not even in the call yet. Hey, guys, I'm here. Don't start the tier list. Where the f were you, Joe? You were supposed to join the Discord call like 20 minutes ago. My bad, guys. My daily nap alarm malfunctioned. Wow, huge surprise. Sleepy Joe was sleeping again as usual. Uh, what are we ranking today? We're ranking Candy Joe. Yes, we're ranking Candy, something you should consider getting more of so you can attract more kids and sniff their hair. You old perverted piece of dog sh First up, we have Snickers. You're not you when you're hungry. Donnie is himself when he's hungry, because when the hell is he not gorging himself to the entire McDonald's menu? And you're you when you're a useless, sleepy bitch, Joe. Snickers is that one candy you find at practically every house on Halloween, but still manages to be tasty every time. It's not the best, though, so I'll put it in A tier. Next up, we have Milky Way. Milky Way is trash. The asteroid belt is cool and all, but sometimes they can be a bunch of rocky bastards and mess with my spaceship and high score. The flying saucers, on the other hand, are being hidden by the government and are secretly being used to make tomato sauce for pizza behind the American people's backs. Joe, what the hell are you talking about? Joe's dementia is acting up once again, so I will go ahead and be this channel's savior as usual and put Milky Way into B tier, since they're all right. We're moving on to Hershey's. Hershey's is amazing. It's a classic chocolate bar and everyone loves it. I'm saying S tier. Joe Hershey's is about as dull as your ancient childhood memories. Donnie, you're so fat that your baby photos are just aerial shots of your crib. I would say something about your baby photos, Joe, but they don't exist because your birth date predates the camera. Jesus Christ, can you two just stay on topic for one goddamn video? Video? No. no. Gee, thanks for the effort, guys. Anyways, I'm putting Hershey's into B tier since they're pretty plain, but not a bad candy by any means. Next up, we have Jolly Ranchers. Terrible piece of shit candy, D tier. Donna, you better get used to sucking on candies like Jolly Ranchers. In prison, you will have to suck on things, and I'm not talking about candy. Personally, I will have to go with C tier for Jolly Ranchers. They are quite mid and fall short in comparison to other fruit candies, in my opinion. I'd say C tier as well. Okay, C tier it is. Next up, we have Skittles. Skittles are fire, easy S tier. I don't really like Skittles. They're just a clump of sugar with a color dyed shell. I don't get the hype. And I don't really like you, Joe. You're just a clump of dust with a peanut shell for a brain. I don't get why you're even still alive. We're putting Skittles into S tier and moving on to Twix. Twix are nice. The shortbread and chocolate coating make for a good chocolate bar for sure. Agreed. Another easy S tier candy. Now, where are we ranking Almond Joy? I like Almond Joy. It's underrated tier A for me. Wrong fake news. It's mid. It's going straight to C tier. Yeah, Almond Joys get a C tier for me too. I'm not a big fan. Next up, we have Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Oh boy, I love peanut butter. Joe is into mushy foods that don't shatter his feeble cheekbones. Reese's peanut butter cups are mid C tier. Donnie, if you were a Reese's peanut butter cup, you'd be called racists. Joe, every time you leave a museum, the alarms go off, you old fucking fossil. Come on, Donald. You have to admit the chocolate and peanut butter are a great combo for a candy. Wrong, Obama. Reese's peanut butter cups are just lumpy piles of dog shit stuffed in mediocre chocolate. I think this will definitely cause some controversy in the comments, but I guess I'll put it in C tier. Next up, we have M&M's. I like M&M's. They are quite good. Jill and I like to eat a bag of these bad boys every time we watch a movie. Although it is annoying when I try to pour a small handful and all of those little bastards come spilling out. You know, it kind of reminds me of when- Okay, we're not doing another prehistoric Joe story today. We're putting M&M's into tier A and moving on to Sour Patch Kids. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm a big Sour Candy fan, especially Sour Patch Kids. I'm saying S tier. Sour Patch Kids are a tremendous masterpiece. I love their slogan, sour then sweet. It's like a good way to describe our presidential transition, Obama. I'll put them in S tier. I love Sour Patch Kids. Yeah, we already know you love kids, Joe. Okay, moving on to Airheads. I haven't had one of these in a hot minute, but I remember them being too chewy. The fruit flavors are not bad, but the consistency is what ruins it for me. Airheads suck ass. They taste like that one shitty liquid medicine that your grandparents forced you to take as a kid, D tier. I don't mind airheads. I think they're a nice candy. Joe, we get that your head is full of air, but that doesn't mean you have to like airheads. At least I don't look like a fucking orange airhead, you fat, fraudulent dipshit. All right, I'm just going to go ahead and put airheads into D tier, and we're going to move on to Kit Kats. Kit Kats are an instant S tier. No discussion needed. And Haribo gummy bears are an instant D tier. They suck. All right, how do we feel about nerds? The actual candy is trash, but the name reminds me of the fact that you guys are fucking nerds and it makes me laugh so I will put them into C tier as a compromise. Well, that was rude, but let's just move on. Where are we ranking starbursts? I find the paper rather annoying to tear off C tier for me. Joe, your frail, uncoordinated dinosaur hands do not make starbursts a bad candy. They deserve a solid A tier. Starbursts get an A tier from me too. 
Next up is Swedish fish. Swedish fish are not bad. Fuck those Swedish dickheads, D tier. Oh, come on, Donald. Now, what's wrong with Swedish fish? What isn't wrong with Swedish fish, Obama? It says Swedish in the name, and that's all I need to know. End of discussion. Moving on to Twizzlers. I love the cherry ones where you can peel off small strips. It makes eating them so much more fun. Joe, you should take a DNA test. You might be related to a Twizzler because you're both a shriveled bitch. Twizzlers are going straight to C tier. This is a bunch of fucking malarkey. I like Twizzlers. I'm done with this shit. Sleepy Joe leaving the call is like music to my ears. Comment down below, Candies, we didn't include and let us know where you'd rank them. 